Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we'll be looking at how we can get rid of video background using Canva with just one click. So let's get started. You would have noticed that I had not been uploading new videos for the past few months. I had uh, COVID and then I got lazy. Now that I'm back, I saw that Canva had released a lot of new cool features and I'm very very excited to share them with you. So stay tuned and I will be uploading uh, on a regular basis so every week you can expect uh, one video or more so let's get started with the today's video first to go into your canva app or your canva website and uh, start by creating a design you can choose videos as uh, templates or you can choose it from that blue box over here you can uh, easily find a lot of uh, cool video templates over here. Let's start by creating a blank one uh, at the moment. Okay, from here you need to find some videos or you can upload your own videos uh, which you want to edit. Okay, I'm going to find some videos from here. I'm just going to type in flying and uh, find some videos from here. Choose videos. And uh, from here, let's uh, see. Uh, I see two birds uh, flying. Maybe I can use this. Okay, I'm going to use this. Just click on it. Okay, once this is here, you go into edit video on the right hand corner. I'm oh, sorry, on the left hand corner, and then you click on the background remover. I'm sorry, guys, this is just for the pro users. So, free users, uh, if you want to use this feature, you can sign up for a 30 day free trial. You can find the link in my description box below. So once uh, you have uh, clicked on uh, background, I mean uh, the video background remover, you'll be able to see that it has been removed. And uh, I'm going to just choose another video and uh, put this as a backdrop over this. And uh, you can see that I've combined two videos into one and have changed the landscape uh, or the the video entirely. So I have two birds flying, and you can see that it is not very crisp, but uh, it actually does the work. It is much better than a lot of uh, other video editing software out there. And uh, this one, if you have a pro subscription, it is actually a cool feature to have. So you can see that, okay, the birds are flying a bit uh, weird. I think it is the timing issue. So one video is longer and uh, the other one is short. So I just have to go in and uh, make the timing the same for both videos and they will sync pretty much nicely, okay. So I'm going to change the 26.7 to 6.2. Okay, so now if I play this, it will actually look as if it is uh, one video. All right, it was looking much, much better if you can see what I mean. So this is basically what you need to do. You need to find the video that you need to edit and then you need to just click on the video background remover. And then you'll be able to see some of the videos might not be crisp because it is still in a beta version and uh, you can see uh, glitches here and there but then uh, mostly like most of the time I'm giving you a lot of examples in this video and you can see that most of the time it works very very nicely so this is a picture this is a video of a bird and uh, you can see that some of the birds uh, they are not uh, very clear okay let's just wait Okay, you see that uh, this is uh, not very clear. Some of the birds are like blurred out. But uh, this is uh, still in beta stage as uh, more and more people start using and more, more and more videos get edited. The AI will pick it up and uh, we will have a seamless integration of this. And we will have a, like a very good uh, video remover app uh, within Canva that we can use. This is still okay. It looks nice and crisp, but uh, I, uh, it's still not sharp enough for me. Okay, so let's start. Uh, maybe let's do another video. I'm just going to go back. Okay. Okay, I'm going to delete these two videos. I'm going to just uh, go to the video section over here on your left hand corner. And from here, I'm going to choose something a bit more complex. Uh, maybe with the people, maybe. Okay, let's just scroll a bit more and see what we can find. Okay, this this person looks good. Okay, I'm going to use this. Okay, and I'm going to uh, click on edit the video and I'm going to do the background removal. 
and you can see how crisp and clean this image or this video is this one basically if you are um, like doing presentations or anything you can actually use this video remover and uh, you can actually put this version of yours into an element circle element uh, you can crop it into a circle you can make this as a you know like a talking uh, talking bubble or anything you know you can do a lot of things see this so uh, you can actually put him at the side and just uh, see the landscape change and you know this is as if he is in the mountain area and he's scrolling his phone you know like it is two different videos and we have combined them into one and it looks very very seamless so if you're giving presentations and stuff you can actually make use of this if you are recording video in a um, uh, uh, and your background is a green green screen or blue screen or white screen you can actually very very nicely make uh, this um, make use of this video background remover okay now you can see that you know we have easily made out a cutout or a BFO, neatly arranged it okay so if you're giving a presentation this is a cool feature that you can use and uh, if you want uh, something like normally we see that uh, as we are talking we, uh, our background is something different so we, if you want to do that uh, you can actually um, and if you don't have that color backdrop what you can do is just uh, remove the background of your video and then uh, put it over here and uh, just create a new background color and then save that video as uh, mp4 and then re-upload it back into canva so this is how we do it okay don't put it in the elements tab yet we are going to change the color of the background uh not black maybe yellow yeah this is a very uh, common color and uh, we can just uh, cut it crop it a little bit make it a slightly bigger and then save this as a video file first okay click on share and then click on download and save it as an mp4 video and done so once this is saved i'm going to re-upload it back into canva and i'm going to put that video inside my element circle element and i'm going to resize it and uh, there we have it yep so this one i can put it into that uh, another video or my presentation video and i can use it as such so there are a lot of things that you can do all right maybe i'll just resize this a little bit and yes we have a presentation video right there okay you can see the difference Basically, once uh, this uh, is not in the beta stage and it is much more you know, developed, I think uh, we'll have a very crisp video editing software on hand. And that'll be very cool. And uh, we'll have everything within Canva itself. Okay, now let's move on to Jiffy. You'll have to go into more section on your left hand side. And from there, you can find this Jiffy file. If you click on it, you will be able to see that it is a video file, but no, it is a GIF file, but and you won't be able to edit the background or anything. So basically, what we need to do is we need to go and save this as an MP4 video file and then re-upload it back, just like what we did on the previous video, and then we will be able to use that and remove the background and so on. So that is what we can do. So I'm going to do the same okay i'm going to show you this one this is a gif file and i'm going to i have uploaded this video file this is what i did actually save the gif file as a video file and then re-upload it back in so now i have this and i can edit this video as i see fit so i'm going to edit this i'm going to remove the background okay so now you can see that the background is removed if you start playing you can see that it is quite seamless even though it could be better but then i can crop it and use it still okay i'm going to put this into another scenario or another video and see how it turns out okay i'm just going to place this little fella maybe at this 
left corner okay and I'm going to change the video background I'm going to choose another video and uh, change the scenario okay maybe this apple yes okay I'm going to just flip it okay flip the background I want, I want the apple to be on the other side or maybe not let's see I'm just going to play this okay wait a minute okay I'm going to flip it flip it horizontal yeah it looks a bit of a it's a spacing issue basically nothing else okay so you can see the video is seamless it's very very nice it actually very very nice so uh, this is some ways that you can uh, use uh, this uh, video editing software hope you have fun there are so much things you can do in canva and they have a lot of cool new features that uh, have come and i will be sharing with you all of those things in the coming weeks so i'm not saying that uh, this video editing software is 100 percent accurate or so like uh, this example it's not at all accurate so there will be some videos which we will not be able to you know like remove the background completely but we need to find a way to work around it but uh, eventually it will get better and better and better and uh, then we'll be able to use that uh, to do our uh, all our work in canva so this is a very cool feature and i welcome it very very wholeheartedly and uh, i hope you have fun with it too so take care and bye bye if you like this video please like share and subscribe thank you so much for watching bye bye